Okay, I'm going to be working on the cowboy for a little while. I might remove the horse's head because I need to work on detailing that as well. Uh, there's a lot of problems with that head, and I'm not totally happy with it for that reason. So I may have to uh, remove it to work on it. I've got to adjust this head a little bit. Time to play with some clay. I've got to redo the uh, shoulders and the uh, neck area for the head. And uh, so I need to take the head off to, to do that. Okay, I'm going to move the jackrabbit away from the uh, clay because I don't want to take any chance of uh, damaging this while I'm working on this part of the clay. There's a lot of work to be done. I've got to redo the head of the horse and uh, because I'm not happy with the head of the horse at all. And it's been damaged quite a bit from uh, sitting on the shelf for, well, for over a year, maybe two years now. The ears I had to reduce the size of because they were the almost the size of a mule ear, and uh, that was pointed out to me by a couple of friends of mine. <laughs> I knew it; I just hadn't got around to changing it. So I'm going to have to cut the head off the horse and put it on my jig and work on it separate. And I've got to build up the courage to do that, but. Uh, Anyway, that's so I can work on the horse's head at, at a better angle than what it is at right now. I may have done that in the first place. And so it may already be re disconnectable. Is that a word? Anyway, so I'm just going to keep on working on uh, this and uh, working it all out. I'm not going to put his hat on. I... I really like the, um, the 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 facial expression and the eyebrows, uh, like he's a little worried or not quite sure what's going on. Okay, I'm going to have to do a little work on this vest I've got on him.
All right, I'm going to make the hat because I'm going to have to put the hat back here. And uh, i got to make it fit his head. So i got to take a measure of the depth of his head and then the width of the head. All right, I've just worked out the uh, crown of the hat. Now i got to work out the brim. And uh, I'm just going to draw little dots that I will eventually connect that will give me the shape of the brim I'm doing it on a piece of wood so I can work on it all the way around without have to constantly turn my turntable. I'm going to build up the crown first. Okay, I just got to clean up that uh, area between the crown and the uh, brim. And join it up. Okay, I put a little bit of a curl in the brim. Looks better than the uh, full blown curl. Okay, that looks good. I'm going to put a wire going through the hat into the uh, body of the cowboy to keep the hat in place. I don't want to come down here tomorrow and find it down laying on the ground. Okay, I'm going to make it a fondue stick instead of a wire. Oh, got it coming out its front. <laughs> That's a little far. Let's get that back in a little bit. And that's plenty good enough. And I'm going to clip that. Okay, I'm going to clip it right there. That'll keep the hat on. That's the goal. Just have to cover up that hole to put a little piece of clay over it. Voila! Yeah, that works out better. So I'll continue this tomorrow and uh, work on his clothing a little bit more and build up the courage to uh, remove that uh, horse's head. 
Yeah, I think that's a better position for the cowboy hat anyway. I've uh, been debating what to do with it, and I like the curl on it because that just helps with the uh, design of the whole piece. All right, everybody. See you next time. Good night. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.